Welcome to Beaumont's Home Kitchen, Spaghettini Carbonara. Let's get started. So we spent an uh, hour or so trying to make a uh, fresh pasta with fettuccine and it was a complete utter disaster. Um, so, so I'm doing spaghetti carbonara with uh, bacon and uh, bacon. Yeah, this is some bacon carbonara. So. Spaghetti, spaghettini into the pasta water. It's always good to fork the uh, pasta so it doesn't uh, stick. I would suggest if you're tired, don't try to make fresh pasta because it's sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So uh, yeah, I think I'll maybe I'll stick with the. Uh, it's easier to do uh, fresh stuff pasta than uh, these other noodles. I guess I gotta practice in the my art, that's it. <laughs> yeah, but... Oh well, some things will work, some things won't. All good. But spaghettini with the um, carbonara, that'll work. Yes, and there's a lot of different dry noodles you can get as well, so it doesn't have to always be fresh, because fresh sometimes technical. Maybe I have to watch more uh, past videos to learn. A little bit of olive oil in the pot. So that would have been great. But hey everyone, happy Easter. Also I have an Easter joke for you. So uh, for Easter I was at work, I was I was wondering where, well yesterday I was wondering where the rabbits were. Because you know, I have rabbit for dinner, have Easter bunny for dinner. <laughs> I got a laugh out of it. I don't know if you will, but I, I think bunnies should be on sale, right? Cook a cook rabbit stew on 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 uh, in, for Easter, mm -hmm. they should be on sale. Some some of the, the places that I worked, you know, sometimes we put them on sale just for just for a joke, right? But some garlic, you know, a thousand cloves of garlic. All right, spaghetti is getting happy. Okay, yes, I, I threw out the fettuccine because it was just not fettuccine; it was clumpy, stick all together. <sighs> Probably would have been tasty, but. It was, Chunk of freaking dough you can't you can't serve that crap. Mm. Garlic chop, boom. No, chopper uh, bacon up. As I cook my pasta, I was gonna mention one thing. So a butcher this time of year. Uh, it seems like every holiday, it's so crazy at work. It's like um, yeah. I probably cut um, cases and cases of beef today. It's a lot. But everyone wants their steak for for uh, for Easter. A lot of beef today. Wow. Oh. The New York strip loin steaks. Um, they're on sale so we have like two different types. Um, a sterling silver and a, like, like the Canadian AAA. Sold uh, I think it's close to 10 cases today. So Beaumont trying to do fresh pasta after a day like that, not a good idea. But spaghettini, we can work with that. It kind of sucks I spent an hour doing that and I threw it away because it, was, it wasn't working. Mind you, the last time I did it wasn't bad, it didn't stick, it was, you know, a little bit of stickiness, but it wasn't too bad, but, oh well. I will do another stuffed pasta recipe. So I'm thinking three eggs, we'll uh, start with two. Two eggs. Okay. Beat the eggs. Alright. Now, check out our pasta here. Mm -hmm. Looking good. Oh, there's so many dishes you can do with dry pasta, so that's this is fine. No problem. I'm looking for the part. Oh, perfect, perfect. You know what we do with this? Parmesan cheese. In with the eggs. Oval into the pan. Keep that up. Bam. Thyme leaves. Mmm, fresh thyme. Feel free to put whatever herbs you like in there. Pretty good. I have this thing for thyme. I don't know if you know that, but I like the thyme. Put some in there. Put the garlic in there. Corn. Oh, what the heck? On. Throw some thyme. Throw some thyme in there. All right. Mmm. 
starts to smell a little. Alright, and I'm going to take our spaghetti. Spaghetti into the pan. Alright. Into the pan. Where it's pretty hot, so we're gonna dump the egg in there, okay? And all we're gonna do is stir, okay? Enjoyed watching Beaumont's Disaster Kitchen today. I might even show a little bit of the Disaster Fresh Pasta. That could be fun, but cheers. Thanks for watching Beaumont's Kitchen. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share. See you next time.